Dad? Ted, what are you doing here? How'd you find me? Uh, Gina, she took me an appointment here. Look, there's some things I need to discuss with you, Dad. I don't have time right now. I'm expecting someone. Well, I'll leave just as soon as it gets here, but I need to talk to you, all right? It's important. Ted, this is no place for you. Go on home. We'll Dad, talk later. wait a minute. No. Look, it's about Sophia. I don't want to hear it. Now, wait a minute. I had a long talk with her, all right? And she said that night at the presidential suite, you only overheard part of the conversation. No. No. I heard what I needed to hear. Now, Ted, I'm going to tell you one more time and for the last time. I don't want you seeing or talking to her ever again. Dad, I can't do that, all right? She's my mother. I love her. How can you love someone who, who betrayed you? She left you and, and your brothers and sisters for Lionel Lockridge. Now, how can you possibly know that, huh? Some things you know instinctively. Yeah, well, this time I think you're wrong, Dad. Now, I saw you at her funeral. I saw you cry. You loved your dad. I don't know what you're talking about. And you still love her. Only you won't admit it to yourself or anybody else. Okay, get out of here. You have no right being here saying these things to me. You know, I, uh, I think you should stop lying to yourself and admit it. You still love her. Just as much as we all do. Please, leave. I don't want to hear this. Please, God, keep him away. Please, keep him away. 